It's always inspirational to face young people that are doing the most and ensuring that they use their talent mm -hmm. as well as uh, you know, their energy to just do something in life. And of course, on Youth on the Block, for today, we have an interesting character. He's a radio personality for one of the most happening radio stations in the country. And of course, we'll get to learn more about him here on the Youth on the Block. Welcome to Youth on the Block. Uh, welcome, Mike. Yeah. Okay, so um, basically, let's just begin uh, first things first. What are your phone names? What name do you use on air? And what do you do you take? Okay, so I have a lot of names, but I don't know if uh, I have to mention them. It's true. Okay. I'm Raptor, so that can be sad. Oh, crazy band. Yeah, because I'm sure you would have a lot of questions. Yeah. And of course, I'm, I'm from Kiko, where I'm going to be the end of a big game of my life. Okay. Um, what's your, what's your stage name? Uh, my system is crazy. Yeah, and some call me DJ Crazy, but uh, on air, um, I'm crazy at this point. And so, crazy, what, what exactly do you do? Okay, so there are a lot of things I do actually, but uh, the first thing is um, my, my, like from 8 to 17, I'm a radio uh, producer, and apart from that, uh, I'm a radio presenter as well. So, I present uh, different shows, like uh, the Popular Showdown, the Space Line, there's also DJs Burnout, and uh, on Sundays, I do the R&B stuff. And apart from that, um, I'm also a club DJ to some extent. Uh, I, I play at events. And apart from that, I'm um, under a media company, so a beautiful program. Ah, friends, we're right down. Okay, so much to do for such a young person. How are you balancing your private life and so many things that you're doing with your career? It's, um, it's a very big challenge. It's a very, very big challenge. But the, the one thing I do is I just plan my day. Each and every day, I know first of all what I'm supposed to do at what time, and uh, also I look at first of all, the most important thing and something that I have to do no matter what happens in that day. Would you say your job is uh, demanding? It's fun. Well, how would you describe your job? I used to listen to radio a lot when I was younger, and uh, I always thought. It, it would be a nice thing to be on radio, so I've always wanted to be on radio. And me being on radio right now allows me to be a person that I thought I would be when I'm on radio. Even more actually, yeah, I, I never uh, knew that I would be the crazy that I am on radio. But it, it's a very fun job. But at the same time, people don't really understand that there are a lot of things that happen in the background. Of course, it can be fun, but it's very, very demanding. There are a number of things that you have to do. There are a number of things that you have to keep in check. Uh, there are a number of things as well that go wrong just in the background. So it, it, it may seem like perfect and fun, but sometimes it's, it's also very, very serious. Okay, I don't want to get into what your name means. Okay. <laughs> but your role model, uh, when it comes to, to, to what you do, what's, what's been your role model? Okay, it's, um, it's, it's, uh, it's about a lot of things put in one. Uh, there are a lot of people that I've always looked up to when you know, I look at the media industry. Uh, but growing up, there is one person I used to listen to the most, and that's uh, DJ Kempas. Like, it's one person that I used to follow on uh, the afternoon show, because he used to do a similar show to what I do, and I was always inspired um, about how he used to connect with people. Because he could talk to anybody, and uh, people loved him for that, because he was like a person that anyone could talk to. Even when I would listen to him on radio, I thought he was a friend. I thought, like, I have met him already, so to some extent, um, I'm a bit of that. And now Kepler's uh, owns the radio station of his phone. Mm -hmm. uh, quite inspirational if you ask yeah. me. Uh, those plans for yourself as well? Um, I would say yes. So I also think that maybe you should move that direction and have a radio station. But who knows? I might, I might have a radio station in the future. I don't know. But I just want to be a big person in media. I would like to do everything in media. I wouldn't exactly say what, but I would just like, I just like media because it allows the person to be what they want to be. Beautiful stuff. Now, there are people out there that um, you know, are probably wanting, or rather, are figuring their lives out at the moment and they want to walk right in your shoes. Your words to such a what can they do to become crazy? What, can, what level of discipline do they need? It's a very poor question, and there are a lot of things that come to mind when we talk about that. But one thing I'll say is, I've, I've always wanted to be a radio. I didn't know how I was going to be a radio, but it's a passion that I've always wanted to do. Some people end up without doing what they've always wanted to do. 
because you know how life is. Sometimes you might uh, you know, go to school, you start a job, and if you're comfortable, you want to stay there. So one thing I would say is have, have a dream. You know what you want to do in life, but um, you don't have to like almost like work towards your goal. Like you just said to say, okay, I'm going to do this one day. Sometimes it might not work. Sometimes it might not be for you. So you have to be patient. Well, thank you so much, uh, Crazy, for being our youth on the block uh, for today. We follow your advice and we love what you do. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Um, thanks so much. <laughs> Radio is fun. Radio is obviously something that, uh, you know, not everybody can do, but when you get the chance to do it, amen, you just get to have yourself, uh, you know, some fun whilst you do your job. And of course, crazy, he's doing just that. Been there, done that. And of course, I know how he's feeling when he's flying on cloud nine. But hey, man, from my youth on the top, my name is X for Mike, and it's back to the studio. <laughs> Taxi time for us to end.